Hello people with beautiful faces that are going to Mexico. These tips are for you, especially for the young noobs that are going for their first time. Let me tell you, these are proven seasoned tips that have helped me out and have helped everybody out that's been on a mission trip so far. Trust me guys, this has been really, really tested and these will work. And these will make sure that you will not get got because that's the last thing you want. All right, so you guys will be spending a few days in this bus. And I'm not gonna lie, this is my least favorite part, but with these few tips, you can make this not your least favorite part, and you can get yours. Tip number one, the most important tip for the bus, do not stink up the bus. This means do not fart, do not burp, do not bring Funyuns, do not bring Doritos or chips that will make it stank. Because if you make a stank, it's gonna suck for you, your neighbor, and everybody involved. The most important, second most important, probably the most important tip for the bus is to bring a pillow and a blanket. This is because you will be in this van for like six days. And you want to have some rest. You want to have some quality rest. You don't want to have some cold rest. You want rest where you can just get under your blanket and have a nice couple Z's. Next tip. Always listen to your leaders. This includes Oleg, Kirill, and Zizimisha. These guys have been on more trips than me and you and everybody watching this combined. That's probably not true, but I'm trying to exaggerate a little bit. But make sure always listen to them and nothing will happen to you and you won't get got. Do not forget your passport. Getting to Mexico is easy. Getting out, that's where you'll have a problem. If you forget your passport, we won't see you for another few months. 28. Okay, next border tip. Don't do anything dumb, please don't. At this time, just be quiet and sit tight and listen to what the leader or what the government tells you. Because if you want to mess with the government, you're gonna get in some trouble. Next tip, don't forget to bring some spending money. This means about five to ten dollars a day, maybe a little bit less. And this is for whenever you guys are gonna be going out every day to invite people to church, you will have the opportunity to go into little shops and buy yourself some drinks. You will be able to buy yourself some nice Mexican candy that will break your taste buds for the next six days. <laughs> Always follow the schedule. Drink responsibly. Remember, you guys are in Mexico. It gets pretty hot. So you gotta stay hydrated on that good H2O. <laughs> Whatever you do, do not take pictures of the Mexican police. If you wanna know why, ask Vadim Shaban. Somos rumos y queremos invitarnos de drama de Navidad y les la playa y la bla 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 bla. She got the rich to tip a ruski. Mexicans not like Americans so much. Last of all, never forget that you guys are going on a mission trip. This is not a vacation, this is not one big date. So if you guys are going for those reasons, I recommend you think it over a little bit. But if you follow these tips, I can almost guarantee you that you will get got much less than you will get yours. Always listen to your leaders. This includes Oleg, Kirill, and the other homie. What's his name? <laughs> 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 